The man accused of shooting a Fresno County Sheriff's deputy is expected to face a judge. Investigators say Michael Congdon and Clovis shot Deputy John Erickson. There was a civilian riding along with him who was not shot. CBS 47's Fabiola Ramirez is live from the courthouse in downtown Fresno now following the case. Good morning. Good morning. Well, Michael Congdon is expected to be in court this morning at 830. He is now in jail facing several charges. Meanwhile, Deputy Erickson is recovering. He was shot in the leg last week on Tuesday when he was responding to a call in Toll House of shots fired that steamed from a property dispute. And there was bullet holes all over the deputy's truck. Erickson had surgery for internal injuries and a broken leg. He's now in stable condition. His work ethic hasn't changed. His approach to life hasn't changed. He's just a fun guy to be around, and you know he's got a great sense of you know life and great sense of duty. And he, you know, he's a hard worker. He's one of the hardest workers I've ever known. Erickson has been in the sheriff's office for 11 years now, and as for the suspect, he's facing several charges, including two counts of attempted murder, assaulting a peace officer, and animal cruelty. And stay with that witness news for the latest and also for what's going to happen here at the arraignment this morning. Live outside the courthouse, I'm Fabiola Ramirez, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.